But I'm a feminist, right? I'm definitely a feminist. And I wanted to talk about it because that's not creepy for me to say that, right? I don't love to bang any less for having said it. <laughs> um, and I didn't realise it was a big issue until you say anything vaguely strident and people are like, who invited the frigid puritanical <laughs> And you're like... <laughs> And I didn't really realise, and I was talking to my sister about my ex-boyfriend, um, and his surname is Branch, and she said to me, so when you get married, your name will be Mrs. Josie Branch. And I said, no, if I were to ever get married, my name would be Ms. Josie Long. And she said, oh, I'm sorry, will you be becoming a lesbian? <laughs> I thought we've not quite won the war, if that's your attitude to my choices. And, I wouldn't really mind, but sexism is so relentless and pervasive. Like, last summer, I decided to stop going on diets, right? It's been awesome, right? It's so good. Like, I know, like, I'm a bit... But basically, I now am so happy. I look at women who are slimmer and better looking than me, but on diets, with a kind of smug condescension. It's like... <laughs> Aww. <laughs> You're not happy with yourself. You're <laughs> not your car behind you. Yeah, I carry a few pounds, but I like to think I work it. <laughs> Thank you. So I was like in a really great place about my body for the first time ever. And then Special K began their annual, oh, you know Special K, it's like the cornflake like cereal <laughs> for girls. You know it, right? And they began their annual advertising campaign that goes, women, see if you can get slimmer this summer. Like, not would you like to lose weight, not do you need to, no, just see. <laughs> and I was like, oh, guys, actually, um, I think I'm all right. I think I'll just stay the same. So, just see. Please don't make me go on a diet. I've been on, I don't want to go. You will see. Please don't. don't you just don't. Please don't. <laughs> They're so dry. 